begs his father to let him go. The real boy begs for one last chance to find out who their real son was. After saying that, he asked the cat to go after the fake boy. The cat gave him a fierce look. The fake boy hid behind the man again, but the cat wasn't going to let him go. It jumped and pounced on the boy. The fake boy was chased by the cat all over the yard. Everyone felt strange because the boy had never been so afraid of a cat before. The cat was about to catch up with him. In a moment of desperation, the fake boy ran on all fours. And then, to the shock of everyone's eyes, at the moment the cat bites down, the fake boy turned into an oversized mouse. Then they realized they mistook the mouse for their son. The real son was banished from the house. Finally the boy found the monk as promised. He told the monk what had happened, and thanked him, and wondered, how did he know the fake boy was a mouse? The monk said it was all because of his bad habits. That night, the boy cut his nails by candlelight. Then he threw the nails into the yard. You know there's a human soul in those nails. It can't be thrown around. The boy's nails were eaten by a rat that had come to life. That's why he became a boy just like him. Where do you throw your nails?